Once upon a time, there was a young and lonely witch named Edith. She lived in a cabin that was deep in the woods. There was a lake nearby that was very foggy. She went out into the forest to collect materials for spells and rituals. But while she was out there, she stumbled on a lone grave she had never seen before. With this, she got an idea. She could make her own friend and the woods would become a little less lonely. When she returned home with her artifacts and vessel, she recited the words of the ancient spell. What is, has been, and forever shall be what is. Over and over until the phrase fell into itself. The potion boiled and bubbled like lava in its bottle until it erupted. When the chaos the spell released began to settle, Edith saw not a friend, but an abomination, a sin against nature. She ran the beast out into the woods and locked her door behind her. She felt more alone than ever and began to feel trapped. Exhausted and disheartened by her failure, she went to bed, dreaming horrid nightmares like every night. Tonight she dreamt of reaching into the darkness to be met only with more loneliness. The next morning she awoke. She thought about how to rid herself of the monster. Perhaps she could lure it back into her home and burn the whole place down with it inside. As she was trying to think of a solution, she noticed something unusual. Through the crack in her blind, she saw a sunny, colorful day outside, something she had not seen in the woods for as long as she could remember. She rushed outside to see the sun, and when she opened her door, she saw an arrangement of lovely flowers and crystals on her doorstep. Searching the edge of the trees for who could have left these gifts, she noticed the monster she unleashed. As he lurched towards her, she saw something she hadn't noticed before. Behind the monstrous appearance, there was still a person. Perhaps she had finally found a friend after all. That night, she slept without nightmares for the first time in a while. The end.